Indian Express, Hyderabad, Monday, March 12, 1990. NRS came to beautify Madras. There is still hope, though thy hands may dispute it, that Madras will one day again be a clean and beautiful city as it once was. Look at what happened in Vengishwara second main road in the busy, typical, dirty, Vadaplani area, though narrow, the lower middle class street is spotless. No overflowing garbage or litter and plants line the pavements. In place of the usual political slogans and juvenile graffiti, couplets from the Tirukkural, the ancient Tamil book of Afro aphorisms by the sage Valluvar decorate the walls. Adjust a model road last week, the street is not unique. Thanks to the movement launched by Exnora International, an organization of non-resident Indians, and ex-NRIs to make this metropolis with its deteriorating conditions of living more like pick and span Singapore. The residents have to be motivated, they have to be approached and talked to in a manner and language they can understand. And that is what we have learned to do, says Explora International's President Mr. M. V. Nirmal. About 10,000 families are involved in Civic Explora, which has already been launched in Pune. Plans are afoot to start in Kochi, in Kerala, and Hyderabad, in Andhra Pradesh. Mr. Nirmal told PTI that. The aim was to light a spark in at least one city in each state so that the movement would spread. Initial canvassing over a stage has been reached in Madras when people wanting to join the movement approach EI themselves. EI also acts as a bridge between people and civic authorities. The residents elect office bearers and contribute rupees 10 a month towards maintenance. A street beautifier is appointed and helped to get a bank loan to buy a car to collect garbage from each house. That satisfying Exnora International's twin aims of promoting cleanliness and providing employment. Youth and children are also involved in the movement and in some areas bring out booklets on civic rights. The Eli Poets Garden area in South Madras is among those participating in the movement. Its VIP residents include AI ADMK General Secretary Ms. Jayalalitha and Matini Idol Rajnikant. As such, political writing and film posters on the walls seem inevitable, but the residents have assured cooperation. Explora has also suggested radical steps to beautify the environs of the Kuvam River which minders sinking, turbid and polluted through the city, its banks lined with huts and widely used as a public latrine. Alongside the steps being taken to clean up the river itself, it has suggested that government use its banks for horticulture and vegetable cultivation, besides setting up a botanical garden and planting, Avicinia's trees which would absorb the ethane as gas emitting from the near stagnant water. Civic Explora is only one of EI's ideas. It plans to launch a security system in the isolated Nilangare suburb involving ex-servicemen.